this is Rob Swatsky from the York campus of Harrisburg Area Community College, and in this podcast we are continuing our review of the muscles of the lower extremity. Our next muscle is the gluteus minimus. The gluteus minimus is the smallest and deepest of the three gluteal muscles. The gluteus minimus, the gluteus medius, and the most superficial and largest of the three, the gluteus maximus. The gluteus minimus is easy to remember because it's the smallest, and just remember, mini, miniature, for its small size. The gluteus minimus originates from the ilium and inserts onto the greater trochanter of the femur, that large, prominent, superior bony process on the thigh bone. And it's a major insertion point for many other muscles we'll be considering in the lower extremity. The gluteus minimus actions include abduction of the thigh at the hip to bring the leg away from the body at the hip, as well as medial rotation of the thigh. It also helps to keep the pelvis level along with our next muscle, the gluteus medius. The gluteus medius lies superficial to the gluteus minimus. In fact, it covers the entire gluteus minimus. And its position is easy to remember in relation to the three gluteal muscles. The medius, think medium, in the middle. It's in between the deepest minimus and just underneath and uh, deep to the gluteus maximus, which is the most superficial of the three gluteal muscles. The gluteus medius has the same origins and insertions as the minimus. It originates from the ilium, inserts onto the greater trochanter, and also shares the same actions of thigh abduction at the hip, as well as medially rotating the thigh at the hip. And as I'm drawing the muscles onto the skeleton, I'm using red for the belly of the muscles and this gray color to indicate the tendon that is at the origin and or the insertion point of the muscle. I am also drawing in these lines reflecting the direction of the muscle fibers, which is a very helpful indication of action as muscles are pulling against the bones that they are inserting upon. Our third and final muscle of the gluteal group is the gluteus maximus. This is the largest and most superficial of the three gluteal muscles and the name is easy to remember because maximus think maximum biggest most prominent of the three and it's used a lot in maintaining the body's upright posture as well as during activities such as running and jumping and climbing the muscle originates at the ilium and on the iliac crest medially towards the sacrum and it inserts on the femur on the gluteal tuberosity which is a roughened portion, a bumpy portion on the posterior femur, more proximal point. And its action is extension as well as lateral rotation of the thigh 